Right. What else do we see? What do we think we need to do? Kira. Um, I see pears. You see pears. Yes. I see pears too. I see so many pears. What do you think we need to do? So we see pears and we see monsters. What do we think? What do we think? So Gigi's gone to his next step. He has to think. I saw Melinda's hand. What do we think we need to do? Um, The monster needs to eat the pears. Okay. I bet the monsters are hungry. That's very good. Now, let me check on LJ. How are we doing here, my friend? Ooh. How many pairs does he need? Uh, five? There's, you think five? Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's give this monster five pairs. Hmm. Oh. oh, what did that show us, LJ? Two. Oh, two. Now, why do we think the monster only needs two? What is this little clue we see over here? You see that? How many pairs is this monster eating? Good job. Okay, so should we feed this monster too and see what happens? It might be our clue. Go ahead and give it a try. Dun da da da! Nice work. Okay, now oh, I like what you're doing. Counting those apples and your monsters. Nice work, LJ. Keep up the good work. All right, Kira. <gasps> My favorite fruit. What is it? Oh, good job, my friend. You counted by tens. We've got LJ counted by twos. So we're skip counting, right? Now, how is this problem sort of like skip counting? What could we count by? Kira. Five. We can count by fives. Who can count by fives? Everybody want to do it with me? We can all do it together. Ready? Five. Ten. Ten Fifteen. 15 20, Twenty. Twenty-five. Nice. Thirty. Good job. Okay, so let's think about this. If we're counting by fives and our case has three rows in it, how many cars can it hold? Oh, LJ, you did it. 